I just wanted to do a quick short video on how to fix some of the trim. Here I have my 97 GMC 1500 and uh, you can tell where the sun kind of got to the trim. It's all cracked. You can see the white kind of coming through. It needs to be peeled up. Now I'm not saying I want this to look brand new but I definitely uh, want this to look better. This is definitely uh, an eyesore. Now heading over to this side, this side definitely had it worse. Now when we bought the truck about four years ago, this already had it on there. So as you can see, I already taped this side up. Didn't take me too long, took me a few minutes. I went to Walmart and bought three cans of this Rust-Oleum undercoating. It was on sale for like $2.97. So I figured, hey, I can't go wrong. Bought three of them just because, you know, these are always a good thing to have. I'm sure it won't take me three cans to go ahead and do this but uh, yeah we'll give it a shot we'll see how it turns out yeah I can see I spent a little more time taping up this side probably did a much better job uh, right here where it says the GMC 1500 I'm probably gonna just wipe that out with some acetone uh, paint over it and then wipe it out and then uh, we'll see how this whole thing looks Wow, I'm impressed. I know I could have used the uh, six dollar can of the rust-oleum auto trim But I really like the way that the rust-oleum undercoating gives it that factory molded plastic look so instead of buying all new trim, you know this was a much cheaper, much easier route to go. And all it took was 45 minutes to mask off, 5 minutes to scrape off the loose stuff, and 5 minutes to paint, if that. Uh, right here, I went ahead and left the 1500 logo black because I really liked how that looked. I went ahead and used acetone over the GMC, and that came off no problem. All right, so all in all, I used half a roll of $10 tape that blue stuff, painter's tape, uh, half a can of the Rust-Oleum undercoating and about an hour of time. I'm not sure why I waited so long to do this, but uh, it's definitely been on my to-do list for about the last year. Not a bad deal for under 13 bucks. If you like the video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you have any questions or comments or a better way to do it, please, by all means, let me know.